Hello and welcome to PowerPoint Designer. In this tutorial, we will see this line chart animation only on just PowerPoint 2016. You can download this video from the description box. Hope you will enjoy this video and watch till the end. First of all, select a rectangular shape, drag it over here, then change its outline to no outline, then change its color to white color. I am using this rectangular shape for making the x axis of the line chart make it little bit smaller then select this rectangular shape again make it duplicate by pressing the ctrl d then make it more smaller press shift and down arrow now place this rectangular shape over the x axis this shape indicates the point of the x axis make another duplicate make another duplicate make another duplicate place these shapes in different position to indicate the different point in the x axis so the x axis has been done now select this all the shapes make it group press ctrl d to make another duplicate of this shape just rotate it and press it here make another duplicate of this shape in the right side of the shape so these two shapes indicates the y axis so make it a group then select a circle shape resize this circle shape make it more smaller then no outline and fill it with white color then make another duplicate of this circle shape place in the zero position then make another duplicate of this circle shape place on the right side of the x y axis here is our two axis has been ready now select one of the rectangular shape and make a copy of this shape and increase its size pressing the shift and up arrow to make it wider then rotate this rectangular shape change color to the same color select a circle shape place it over here select this x axis and y axis make that these two shape group then bring it to front make the rectangular shape send it to back now select this rectangular shape go to animation select whip animation then select this circle shape go to animation and select zoom animation Similarly, we will make the other part animation. Press Ctrl D to make it in the duplicate of this shape. 
make a little bit rotation of this shape change this color to the second color select this circle shape and place on the right side of the red color select this red shape again and make another duplicate of this shape make a little bit rotation on this shape and send it back select the circle shape make a duplicate of this shape then press over the rectangular shape I'll make this shape a little bit rotate now change this color to the yellow color select this rectangular shape make a duplicate of this shape then make a little bit rotation on this shape and change the size of this shape a little bit larger than the previous send it to back Now change this color to this color then make another duplicate of this circle shape place it over here so our line animation has been ready now we will do the title of this line select this rectangular shape Make a no outline, select this rectangular shape again and change this color to the first rectangular shape color. And resize it and place on the right side of the last shape. Make these two shapes a group, place it over here. And select a rectangular shape no fill and no outline you can put the title of this line change this font and increase this size make it uppercase and bold place on the right right side of the of this shape go to animations animation pen then select this uh, text box select this fly in and change the position uh, movement of this animation from left I will make it more slower the duration will be two seconds and make it with previous this title will come after the first line so this animation has been ready now select this all the animation this oval animation make it with previous Then select these two shapes, press Ctrl T to make a duplicate, press below the previous one and change the animation position after the rectangle 59. Make another duplicate, I will change the color of this shape to the second line. Make another duplicate of these two shapes. This below the previous one. And change the animation position after the rectangle 61. Change this size, change this color.
select this to shape again press ctrl D to duplicate again we will change the position of this animation after the rectangle 65 now change this change this box color to the background color and select this four shape and send it to back so that the animation of this in each shape will come under the left shape make it after previous this line will come after the previous one Let's check the animation. So here is our animation has been ready. Hope you like this video and hit the like button and press the subscribe button to inspire us to make more videos on PowerPoint.